Today we're going to be taking a look at the Rolla TX-104 4 bike rack for 2 inch hitches, part number 59401. The Rolla TX-104 is a great bike rack for families with multiple bikes and can carry both kids, road bikes, alternate frame bikes, and mountain bikes. To prevent theft and tampering, the bike rack also comes with an integrated cable lock which will wrap around your bikes and then provide that additional security. When loading up to four bikes, you want to make sure you don't go over its 100 pound weight capacity. Now with the bike soft, we can take a closer look at some of the features. The first one being the cradles themselves. These are adjustable along the arms of the bike rack itself. And it's also made of this soft rubber material, which is going to be easier on bikes so they won't scratch them or up once you have them installed. Now for close quarter situations, such as parking in your garage or just parking in general, you need more clearance in the rear. The, these arms do fold down. To do that, you grab this red handle, lift up, let the arms fold down, realign the holes there, and push it back down into place. All right, now if you need to gain rear hatch access, this does tilt away from the vehicle, although you cannot do this when the bikes are still attached. To do that, you come to the base here, loosen up this pin and clip, lift it up, and tilt it away. And now we have full access to our rear hatch to get whatever we need, and we're gonna have plenty of space on either side to do so. This bike rack is for two inch hitches only. It comes with its own anti-rattle bolt, and that's gonna take the shake and play out of the shank, which is gonna make for a much smoother ride down the road. Now that we've gone over some of the features of the bike rack, let's go ahead and show you how it installs. Let's go ahead and put it into our two inch hitch here. You wanna line up the pinholes, and then we're gonna install our anti-rattle bolt and clip. Okay, with our holes lined up, We'll take our anti-rattle bolt and washer, put that through, just and screw it in. One of the nice features about this bike rack is the fact that it actually has its own tightening tools. You don't need any additional tools to install this in your vehicle. You want to get it tight enough just so all the shake and play is out of the shank. That looks good there. Now we'll go ahead and put our clip in. Next we're going to go ahead and lift the arm so we can actually put our bikes into place. Lift up, bring the arms up, and then realign the holes at the top and reinsert the pins. Next, we're going to get our bike rack prepped to actually put bikes on it. To do that, first we'll just go ahead and loosen up the straps, move some of our cradles out of the way to make it easier for them to fit. Now, you always want to put the heaviest bike closest to the vehicle. Okay, we'll go ahead and put our anti-sway strap on first, and our two top straps. Now with some alternative frame bikes, you may need to purchase a bike adapter bar, which you can find on eTrailer.com. All right, with all our bikes secured on the rack, let's go ahead and take it out on the test course and show you how it looks. First, we'll take it onto our slalom course. This will show you the side-to-side -side action such as making turns or evasive maneuvers. Now we're at the alternating speed bumps. This will show you how it looks driving on uneven pavement or potholes. Finally, we're at the solid speed bumps, which simulates going into your driveway or parking lots. And there you have it for the Rolla TX-104 4 bike rack for two inch hitches, part number 59401. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.